Hey everybody, it's Jason from the Texas Gun Vault, and I guess this is going to be my first video to the Texas Gun Vault 2, or the B channel. Uh, this is going to be a channel that I'm going to upload just kind of random stuff to, probably do stuff just based off of my phone, things that I don't think would necessarily be appropriate for the main channel that has kind of become a little bit more, I'm going to put this in air quotes, professional. Uh, but here I can do more like vlog stuff or just stuff in my phone or when I'm out and about things I see or just share kind of memes and stuff who knows uh, could be stuff more about me and other things and aspects of my life than just the channel and this was suggested to me by one of my local subscribers Matt uh, Moore, who is uh, in one of my live streams, said, hey, you need to have a B channel. I said, you know, that's actually probably a pretty good idea. I know other YouTube channels have them as well. So I guess I'm going to create some content that I've been asked to make that I, I never really thought would be appropriate for the main channel because I knew it would not get a lot of views. So uh, let me give you a little garage tour. People have been asking me, let me see the garage. Is this an actual real place? I've actually been accused of actually having like a CGI background or like one of those made up backgrounds and I film in front of a green screen. And I really don't. This is actually really my garage. As I tell people, I'm just a, a average gun guy in his garage filming videos about firearms that he's passionate about. And um, that's the truth. So let me turn the camera around here and I'll give you a little garage tour. All right, so here we go. So uh, right now on the workbench, this is where you guys usually see uh, the kind of the, the tabletop here. Uh, the, actually, right now I have my Mark 18 out here. I'm going to do a parts video on this. Uh, I got my little laptop computer, some other things. Got some radio, some cl gun cleaning stuff. Got this awesome sign here. You guys don't always see. It says, I'm kind of a big deal. My, my wife got me that for uh, Christmas. Uh, then up here I get all of my uh, tools, specialty tools for guns. That's kind of where I hang them here on the wall. You guys can see I'm recording this video at 3.09 in the afternoon, and sometimes you can actually hear the clicking of this clock in the background of my videos. I've had that clock for a long time. It's been a great little clock. I bought it at Walmart probably 15 years ago, so it's been pretty reliable. But up here, I know you guys don't see, I just got bins full of uh, just stuff for the house. Uh, I got some cooking out uh, fire starters and that kind of thing. Then over here, got my... Uh, Stickers. I got some stickers for the for, for, for the outside. On this side, I got mainly gun stuff right here. And then over here, I just got other stickers that I collect from time to time. Some have been given to me and so forth. And then if I open this up, you can guys can see all of my gun cleaning supplies right there. So that's what I use to clean all of my guns. And I just got other just kind of odds and ends. I'm sure most uh, people do. Uh, over here, I have my camera set up. Uh, so this is a Canon 80D. Uh, films in 1080p. And I usually use this Rode shotgun microphone. All this was supplied to me by one of my subscribers who was so nice to donate the money for me to acquire this and upgrade. And I think a lot of people have appreciated that when it comes to my channel. Got a little LED light panel here that I use. I also got another one kind of back there. It depends on the lighting situation. I might have to use one or two. And usually, of course, when you're watching the video, you're seeing it from this perspective right there. And uh, this is a little stool that creaks a lot. So I have a, it's just an old craftsman uh, thing that I got this little cushion on because I'm old and my butt can hurt. And then down there, I always stay on this welcome mat little gun themed and there's my refrigerator sometimes you guys hear in the background as well got a baby yoda magnet on it gotta love that don't even know what's uh in this right now i don't know if i need to stock it or not oh got some mike's hard lemonade some tonic water uh some beer and some mexican cokes that's that, that's what's going on in there today so uh, i got my vice here this is has been a huge uh I guess advantage to have here uh, when it comes to working on guns. I never really had a workbench for a long time and getting this vice to hold things down has been a huge, huge upgrade to my home gunsmithing stuff. Uh, I got some other stuff here. I'm going to try a new microphone setup today. So this is another Rode uh, microphone setup that uses, I guess it's a lapel mic or a lavalier mic. But as I said, uh, it's not a green screen. It's actually my garage and there it is. That's kind of like kind of, kind of usually the perspective that you guys get. So let me walk over here. 
I get accused a lot of having a bunch of candy in the background. These actually aren't candy jars. They're actually full of things for like the sprinkler system, nuts, bolts, and projects that I have uh, kind of around the house. And these right here are is not Epsom salt like it used to be used for, but I have nuts and bolts, everything organized in there and all this down here as well. Uh, so let me see what else I got. Oh yeah, over here. Uh, back here I got pictures of my 69 Camaro and me and my dad. That's the car that we restored. It's currently in North Carolina, but eventually, hopefully, I'll have it here in Texas. And of course, uh, back here got some old license plates. And of course, the Texas Gun Vault one was actually given to me from a, uh, or by a local subscriber. I mean, I'm sorry, maybe not a local subscriber, just a subscriber. I did a mailroom video on that. That was so cool that he found that and has TGV on it. So I hung that right there and... Over here, I have an AK handguard with a tone hole, just like from a cello or a bass. I thought that was really cool. I thought that would be something really neat, neat to hang up here in the uh, garage, of course. And so that's kind of what I have there in the background. And then from the other perspective of my old videos, you can actually see where uh, my old backdrop kind of was. So I got this wall over here full of other gun advertising stuff and stuff for my 69 Camaro. Um, so it's kind of a mixture. I would like to buy more gun advertising stuff to have in the background. It'd be really cool to put over there as well. Uh, but maybe I'll get around to it. So I got my come and take it flag and some other 69 Camaro artwork and so forth. And, and that's it. And of course, then I got all my prepping supplies over there. I got tons of toilet paper, paper towels, tissue paper. I've been laughed at. And there's my light that's out over there. I need to buy a new, um, LED light for that. And then over here, we can go outside. Uh, we recently had this artificial turf installed here in, in, in the yard. Now, don't laugh at all my weeds I have in those beds. I, I really need to go out there and uh, fix that. Need to pull those up. The weather's finally starting to get nice enough for me to go out and do some, some yard work. So if I turn around, you can see it's literally just my garage and where I film. But yeah, this uh, artificial turf is awesome. I need to go out and vacuum the yard because that's actually how I clean it up. I actually have like a little uh, leaf blower that I turn in reverse. But it's awesome. I never have to worry about the grass going bad. And uh, kind of here's my backyard. What I got going on back here. And yeah, there's a whole ton of weeds in there. And then I got this awesome, this outdoor kitchen set up. And that's about it. So that is kind of the garage tour. So you guys can now have an idea of when I'm filming a video of kind of what's around me. So, yeah, there it is. The garage tour of the Texas Gun Vault of where I film all of my videos. So normally, as I mentioned, you're seeing me from this perspective. But I am looking at you from that perspective right there. So there you go. So this is, as I said, kind of the first video of the Texas Gun Vault Channel B. People have been asking for a garage tour video. So there you go. So I'll be posting various videos to this channel, maybe funny stuff, things I don't plan on monetizing, or things that I don't think anybody except maybe my most diehard and loyal fans and subscribers would want to see. So there you go. So I hope you guys like this. And I probably will not be uploading to this very often. And by often, I mean every day, probably every few days or something, or maybe I'll be sitting in my car and have an idea and I'll upload to the channel. So, um, yeah, can I check this out? Uh, of course, if you're not subscribed to my main channel, feel like and you want to go uh, over there, push that subscribe button and hopefully you're subscribed here. And, um, this is just a channel for, as I said, for where I can post other stuff that might not be appropriate for my main channel. So there you go. So maybe I should do a different send-off than I normally do for my other channel. But for right now, I guess I'll just use the old one. So I guess, as always, thanks for watching.